till I die. I'm gonna laugh instead of crying. Get out of the vehicle, get out of the vehicle. I'm gonna take the town and turn it upside down. This guy's gonna hit me for no live, reason, knock it off live my head. Until I die. Oh, come on. They're gonna say, oh, shots fired, shots what a fired, shots fired. I'm gonna play for the sky. Hey, I'm gonna miss the thing. thing. I'm gonna have my fling. I'm gonna live. Hello everybody, it's Tunnel Rat 327 and uh, we're going to be going on duty today as an FBI agent. Uh, finally got the uh, glass to uh, be see-through instead of completely black where you couldn't see the lights through it on this here uh, CVPI. Um, let's go ahead and get in. I'll show you what the, the light patterns are like. It's really simple. It's basically a uh, undercover car, but uh, I'll go through the light stages here. Stage one, it's got the blue and amber in the back, so this is definitely California standards. Light stage two brings up the uh, steady burn red and the blue light here. And then the third light stage adds the uh, wig wags. We'll go ahead and uh, show 10 8, and it uh, looks like we got a stolen police vehicle, so let's go ahead and take this call. Looks like it's going to be coming over the hill here. Dispatch, show me 23, I'm about to 10 11. On the uh, stolen police impala. Oh, it looks like he's going to go ahead and take off on me. We've got a 1080. I'm going to get some backup units in. He's just hitting people left and right here. He's already hit two civilians down. Go ahead and roll the EMS for them. We are on, um, we are parallel to Interstate 2 here in Del Perro, running through the shopping centers. Let me get some additionals if possible. It's going to be priority signal 100. As you can see, I, uh, let's get out of the vehicle. Alright. Here we go. I went ahead and added, um, I put blue lights on all the police vehicles and the sheriff vehicles. I'll show you those in a little bit here, but we're going to be continuing down Prosperity Street. And it looks like he's going to be hanging a left on West Eclipse, so we'll be traveling to the uh, west, south. Uh, I added uh, the versatility mod so that there is a lot more PEDs, uh, a lot more diversity in the vehicles that populate, and uh, a few more cops uh, on patrol. Pull it over guy, pull it over. Alright, I'm going to need some spike strips. We're going to be traveling east on uh, Bay City Incline. We're basically on the two. Okay, looks like we got some tires out. We hit his left side successfully. I need, I need another unit in here to... Uh, Try to box this guy in or something. Oh, that'll do it. Oh, oh, disable. Get out of the vehicle now. Hands on your head. Get on the ground. Face down. All the way down. Alright. Got me covered. <laughs> Some of the comments. Alright, uh, dispatch, we got 110.15. Alright, buddy, what's your deal? Why are you running from the. Why are you stealing police cars? I mean. What do you got on you? Anything to poke me, stick me, otherwise piss me off? No? Alright, I'm gonna have to go ahead and get traffic slowed down here. Uh, I'm gonna just set you in the back of my vehicle for a minute until we can get this traffic sorted out here. Go around, folks. Go around. For crying out loud. Alright, well, I can't exactly search this vehicle, but uh, we're gonna go ahead and get a tow truck out here for this. Oops, I passed it up. Uh, there it is. 
All right, roll me a 1052 for this police. That is smashed. That's that riot handling line on that uh, that rescue truck that came barreling in. Oh my gosh, that thing is absolutely smashed. All right, dispatch, go ahead and uh, go ahead and roll me a transport unit. I'd take this guy in myself, but I'll have to meet him down here to question him. Let's go ahead and pull off to the side here. Alright guy, I don't know what your issue is, but uh, we're going to have to take you in and book you in the system here. Come on. Over here. There you go. This guy's doing burnouts, waiting for the police. Look at them blue lights. It looks absolutely amazing. I mean, I liked it with the red and blue, but the all blue is just gorgeous. I don't know why it's wearing that skin, but... Okay. Uh, dispatch, show us 10-8. We're gonna, uh, we're just gonna roleplay that we went down to the station to question this guy. See, um, basically we could be playing, like, detective or FBI or whatever, but, uh, I figured we'd do something different, give this car a shot. I really do like the light pattern. I'm, I'm a little upset that it doesn't have any on the, on the sides. Um, but the simplicity of just having those basic lights is, is what we were going for with the uh, undercover unit, kind of. As you can tell, it has the uh, regular Crown Vic wheels. And the, uh, what are you doing here? Do I need to get out so you can... Where'd you come from? Hey. We have a possible no drug deal. Oh, hey, thanks a lot. Alright, drug deal. See, that's the kind of stuff we need to look at. And I think... Yeah, we we're already on the location. Uh, let me uh, let me go ahead and open up traffic, and let's see if we can get down to the drug deal. That's the kind of stuff that we need to be handling anyway. Um, but I was gonna say, you look at the it's got the honeycomb or not the honeycomb, but the regular chrome grill in it. So it could just basically be a civilian CVPI. Probably just go ahead and park up out of sight. Maybe right here will work. As long as we can see him. It looks like he's going to be down this hill. Whoops. Yeah, he's going to be down this hill there. So we'll just go ahead and park up here and uh, let him know that we're on scene. A dispatch show us uh, uh, 23 on scene. probably gonna have to get some fuel soon too. It seems like the consumption is uh, pretty. Oh, here we go. We got activity. Let's go ahead and move in and get this guy. Oh, shots fired, shots fired, shots fired. I really don't want to take you out, dude, but you really shouldn't have shot at me. I don't know what the hell your problem is. All that over a few bucks and some drugs. Dispatch, we've got one uh, one down. Go ahead and roll the medics. Attention, all units. Medical and just shooting up. Like, look at that windshield. You almost hit me with that bullet. Units reporting a civilian Took out my dispatch units from a windshield. And Hills Fire Department and looks like that's the only one that went through. It went right through. Units respond code three. Good grief. And um, ambulance is en route. Let's go ahead and set up a uh, little perimeter a couple barricades yeah I got the job script in here uh, which I was using as the player it's it's kind of nice but it needs some more work there needs to be a better accounting system so I added a um, like a bank account thing and uh, that's pretty cool because you can deposit your money into a separate account not like Fleek or whatever or uh, like on single player how you can go to the browser and check out your transactions it's a little different than that but um, that's pretty cool uh, it all kind of needs to be integrated um, but it adds to the immersion a little bit I kind of wish that uh, there was a little bit of an economy system for the single player mode for LSPDFR uh, kind of like they have on 5M because it would add 
uh, a little bit of dynamic immersion to the game because as it is mostly all you're doing is taking calls I mean I got the fuel script and things like that but and what are they smashing into over here just traffic not wanting to move I guess yeah that's good just park it there you don't need to come through the barriers I'm probably gonna go ahead and stop you there in a second if uh, let this fire truck get a little closer that's probably good right there now who's getting out the paramedics or the firemen Looks like the firemen were not nearly as close, and they're going to just keep their sirens running. Well, I'll tell you what. Anyways, we're going to chalk outline this guy. Have him, uh, if, right, if he's dead. Something. Have the coroners come in and run an autopsy. Uh, which we know, we know what happened here. I mean, he pulled a gun. We're just going to have to fill out a report. and uh, That's basically going to be that. Dead. Yeah, I figured they would be, so. Uh, let's go ahead and let these guys take off. The ambulance should be out of here in a second. Such a waste. Yeah, there it goes. Look at that, it's all smashed up. I mean, I love this deformation, the extra deformation, because it is realism. I mean, how often do you smash into stuff with your car? Not very. But uh, when you do, if you're going any kind of speed, you are going to do some damage. Uh, so let's go ahead and roll a corner, and then we'll take down our barriers once he gets on scene, which it looks like they're pulling. I kind of like how they pull off to the side. So they're not always in, impeding with traffic and stuff. But uh, And those are the... Not true. Look at this guy's a bobblehead. What is happening right now? What are you doing, guy? You need to lay off the caffeine, you know? Alright. Well, we're going to go ahead and be code 4 off of that. Good as new. Okay, we got another drug deal. We're going to go ahead and... Uh, take this one and hopefully it'll go a little better than the last one did let's go ahead and pull out here and we'll probably pull into one of these driveways here like right here because we don't necessarily have to roll up on them uh, in the vehicle we can yeah I'm gonna go ahead and watch him from here we can get my firearm ready in case he gets a little out of hand like last time. Uh, dispatch with 23. Alright, where's the, uh, where's the buyer for this guy? Let me see if I can... There they go. Kind of hate being visible. I mean, are they even doing a deal or what are they doing? Just hanging out? I don't really want to move in unless I know that they're. Oh shit! Shots fired, shots fired. You little dick. Get down, get down on the ground. How dare you charge me like that? Just, just hang tight there. I'm gonna need to get some backup in here. Okay, looks like they're gonna get him. He is entirely too far for me to chase down. I mean, that's just. Plus, with my A button not always working right. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and get my vehicle. I'm gonna let this other guy take off. Uh, if he's, you know, not still there, it's no big deal because uh, I don't know. I just bugged out. I don't think he meant to attack me like that. 
Let me get my vehicle here so we can get over there and help secure this guy. Uh oh. And we crashed. So. Okay. So we're back. Um, I went ahead and changed the color to like a like a dark silver, dark steel or something. Um, but LSPDFR crash, and it happens from time to time, especially when certain plugins uh, don't unload properly. Uh, but we're gonna go ahead and uh, be 10-8 uh, available for call. Attention all units, citizens report a domestic disturbance oh, here we go. in the Spooky Canal. Well, we can go ahead and handle this domestic. Uh, let's go find out what the issue is. Come on, open the gate. Uh, Got to scrape up my car, that's great. Dispatch shows in route, uh, code 2 will be uh, 97. So let's go find out what's happening. Apparently there's more information in the uh, computer, I think. Uh, which we can take a look at as we get closer. Can't really do that while we're driving. We'll be smashing into everything. We'll probably pull up on scene and then check the computer. Looks like we are here. That's probably going to be our caller right in front of us there. Let me just check out the uh, call details. Okay, it's showing nothing in the system here, so uh, let's get out and have a chat with this lady and find out what's uh, what's happening. Ma'am, are you the person that called 911? Neighbor and son are always fighting. This time it seems really bad. Please help her. Okay, talk to the family. Alright, let's see. Oh, you got a you got a weapon there, sir? No, you need to buy drugs with my money. Shut that F up and give me my money. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Drop the weapon. What's the matter with you? You alright, man? Wow. That went south quick. Attention all units. Medical aid requested in the What the heck is your problem, dude? Seriously, you're gonna shoot your mother? That is messed up. Hills Fire Department and well, I got some paramedics on the way. Just try to hang in there. I don't. I'm pretty sure you didn't survive that because I, I did hit you in the face and. And um, ambulance. Right to the eyeball, it looks like. Wow. Choices, man. Life's all. He looks young too. That sucks. I had dispatch. We're gonna have one down. Um. Roll EMS. Uh, looks like the mother freaked out and ran away. Uh, but uh, situation is going to be code four at this moment. Oh my gosh, what a shame! I'm going to pull forward here so the EMS have room to get in, and uh, we'll just kind of block off the street a little bit. Let me see if I can get. I got some T dot I can bring out for traffic. Attention, all units. In code 99, in the Spooky Canal. I'm pretty sure I just called them out code three though. They're going to be coming from down the road up here. Somewhere. Yeah, here they come. I think they're coming in the Tahoe. Yep. Oh no, they're coming in the Silverado. Got them set up with the amber and red lights there. That's our uh, female highway patrol based on the Tennessee Highway Patrol uniforms. Looks like EMS is going to be on scene. And here comes the uh, firefighters. Yeah, this thing's pretty nice, isn't it? I went ahead and made some libraries for these, and I think this is one of Candace's trucks. Uh, but I just I changed out the lighting. She had 
I think red and blue. Uh, so I just change it out for amber and red. And what are you doing shooting at them? That's that's not what that's not what I say dot does there. They don't just attack people. Pretty ridiculous. So did he survive? No? James McDonald. Or Jamie McDonald. Well that's a shame. Uh we're gonna have to go ahead and secure the scene. Let's get the corners in here. Uh, maybe I'll let the EMS take off first. Look at T dot just or SA dot, they just moved down the street. That's pretty clever getting out of the way of the ambulance. Alright. So what I did is uh I went into my custom backup menu and just added a category for traffic. Um I added them in code two and code three. But let's go ahead and get the coroners out here then. Boy, those lights are bright on that truck, though. Here comes the coroners. That's good, buddy. Just pull in there. Go get the body. What are you waiting for? I'm not standing anywhere near your path there. Oh, a kidnapping. That's definitely going to be our uh, our scene. So let's go ahead and take that. Dispatch, show us uh, in route. All right, T dot, you can clear out. Looks like they're going to be straight down here. Oh my gosh, the suspension is something else. All right. Turn our lights on. Whoop. Looks like that's going to be our van right there. Watch out, car. Alright, pull it over, guy. Pull it over. Are you going to pull over or what? What in the world are you doing? Oh my gosh, are you absolutely insane? Dispatch, go ahead and send me a 32. Required on Magellan Avenue. They're going to be pulling up in the rescue truck, it looks like. Hey, bud. Alright, allegedly we have a kidnapped victim in the back of this vehicle here, so let's approach with caution. I would code 5, but we're not 100% that that's the situation, so let's just have a chat with this person. How you doing today, ma'am? Um, so the reason I stopped you is uh, there's allegedly a kidnapped individual in the back of your vehicle. And also your driver's license is expired. Right. Well, I didn't look that up in the system, but anyway. Uh, do you have some identification on you, ma'am? And what about your passenger back there? Katie Chief and Julie Shock. All right. Um, doesn't look like there's a question menu, so just sit tight for a second. And you're just going to walk through our scene. That's uh, outstanding. All right. Let's go ahead and look up their information here. Oh, expired for 217 days. Wow. So she's 30 years old, no gun permit. She's been charged with uh, disturbing the peace. Looks like twice. Uh, and she's also been cited for disturbing the peace. Wow. So there you have it. Let's go ahead and pull her out of the vehicle. That woman doesn't really look to be in distress in the bag, so... Okay, 
You need to put your hands on your head now. This time you are under arrest. You moron. And it looks like your partner's under arrest there too. I don't know if that's the case. <laughs> or... It is not, so I don't know what that's all about. But, uh, alright, do you have anything on you, ma'am? Anything illegal, any contraband, anything like that? I need to know before I put you in a vehicle. Because anything you take to court with you or to jail with you can actually be a handgun and a machete. Alright, go ahead and get in the back of the vehicle. I guess we're going to send transport out for the victim. Well, we don't really have time to pick up an escaped prisoner. we got to question this lady. All right, let me go ahead and search your vehicle and see if there's any evidence of anything else going on. Nothing in there. All right. Let's get this thing impounded, and we will tear it apart down here at the shop. What did you think was going to happen? We'll go ahead and take her in. Uh, you can go ahead and take off, dude. We're all set here. Appreciate the help. That's something new. All right, Miss Shark. We have suspicious activity on a movie star way. Assassination. Well, maybe we'll go ahead and take that call. Where are they gonna be at here? Is that them off here to the left or? Oh yeah, they're gonna be up here a little ways. Hello, this is Carlson. Is it this guy? I hope they're not down below here. Look at the car just start rolling. Hey buddy, hold it. Speedy. Don't make me shoot ya. All right. Uh, you got anything on you? You got a weapon? We got reports that you're trying to kill somebody. You got a Zippo lighter. Alright, just hang tight there for a minute. I think they're down below here on the freeway. Let me see if this guy's got anything on him. nothing I think I might have the wrong people here because it looks like uh, it looks like that zone's still moving yep here he comes all right guy hold it I think you're the I think you're the guy you can't charge an at us for no reason go ahead put your hands up stop whatever the hell you're doing all right, who's shooting? Who's shooting? Oh, I got a ding dang taser trying to shoot this guy. This guy's gonna kick everybody's ass. Yeah, this is the guy I was gonna arrest right here. I think that's him. This guy's kicking that guy's. He has no weapons. He's just going around kicking everybody in the face. <laughs> so it looks like we neutralized the subject, which would have been this guy over here. Let's get some EMS out here. Uh, looks like this is the guy that was our assassin. This is the one that we were going to arrest because he came charging at us for no reason. So, uh, and then one of the other guys that we had stopped just decided to take matters into his own hands and, and vigilante start smashing everybody with his fist. 
That was that was definitely interesting. I've I've never seen somebody. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Alright, well let's go ahead and uh, clear out of here. Actually, no, we'll, we'll go ahead and we'll stay on scene here. I mean, we are the uh, we are the detectives, so normally I'd have, I'd wait for the detectives to come clean up, but that's, that's our uh, that's our occupation this time, is, is LAPD or LSPD detectives, so we'll handle the scene. Report at 484 and little soul. Oh my gosh, with those brakes. Come on, guys, they're right here. This is Adam Slide. Copy that. We'll keep an eye out. That's it. Perfect. Come on out. Whoop. And just get hit by a car and bleed everywhere. That's just, he got hit at like five miles an hour. Oh my gosh, that's absolutely nuts. That looks really good. Of course, fire trucks here don't have blue lights either, but I like the way it looks. I don't, I didn't even do anything with the skins or nothing on these. Um, but I kind of like the rotating lights up top, too. Alright. So it looks like uh, nobody survived. So that's... Uh, that's that. Lady, you can't be stomping through the crime scene. Alright? It's just common sense. And you can go ahead... Look at your wheel is all cockeyed. You need to settle down with that driving. There you go. You got room? Fall out. I don't know why you didn't just go down the road and turn, but... Alright, well let's go ahead and get our corner out here. This is just a big mess. Yeah, and you're just gonna smash into everybody. So actually, I think I'm gonna go ahead and start getting ready to clear the scene. Looks like our coroners are already here, so that's good. All right, let's go ahead and uh, Go ahead and drive through here. Find out. Actually, let's just wait for a minute. A person carrying an explosive on um, a bombing attempt. All right. Well, let's go ahead and code three over to that. Respond code three. We're going to do some first person, actually. Watch out there, car. Alright, looks like he's going to be just below us here on the freeway. What in the world? Alright, we better be prepared. Uh, let me get my taser out. All right, guy, what are you doing? How you doing today, sir? Not good. I have a bomb in my hand. I see that. What are you going to do with the bomb? I'm going to use it to blow up your police station, you scumbag. All right, well, how about you get on the ground? Stop! Police! And automatically he switches out his C4 for a pistol. Great. Seems legit. Just don't like police or what? We are code four. Suspect in custody. No further units required. All right. Got anything on you? Yeah. Handgun, a sticky pair of sticky bombs, and YS, whatever that is. All right. Well, I'll tell you what. I'm gonna have to bring the back of the uh, truck.
control for the cruiser here. Get in the car and behave. All right, man. I don't know what your issue is, but uh, yeah, it's not right. And dispatch. Show me uh, one ten fifteen. I'm gonna be ten seven back to the station. See if I can get through traffic without getting smashed into. Go ahead and flip a UE here. And of course it's gonna smash up my car. Oh my gosh, stop smashing into me. And I'm sure the car looks like crap. Now I'm gonna turn off my lights. Yeah, all just smashed in. At least we're heading back to the station. We'll have them fix it when we get there. Okay, let's take this guy into his cell. And that's not going to work because LSPDFR is going to crash, so perfect. I guess that's going to go ahead and do it for this episode. Um, we didn't really do a whole lot of like federal investigation stuff, but we tried to take some of the call-outs that maybe a detective would cover or um, maybe even an undercover officer. So we'll see you again next time. Um, if you got some requests, leave them in the comments. Uh, we can do different vehicles, different uh, departments. Um, just, just leave your request below. And I did end up switching out my sheriff vehicles which uh, I'll go ahead and just show you the uh, Tahoe for the uh, the new light bars that they have oh that's right he's got the tent uh, let's take the tent off of there okay these are the the light bars with the alternating vertical lights there pretty slick it actually comes in red and blue but again I went ahead and uh, I switched it out for all blue and then of course the traffic advisor but that's all the lighting there so hope you enjoyed the episode and we will see you again next time